Hi everyone, this is Jeannie and welcome to my channel. I am going to share with you my little um, notebook here. It's a, it's from Franklin Covey. I don't know if you remember my video I did. I found this at Goodwill and I am going to keep the um, price on here. Where is it? It was $3.99. At Goodwill I just thought it was such a great find and it's all leather and I'm going to show you how I use my uh, what I call my filing cabinet and I used to do this when I worked I kept a filing cabinet in a notebook and I had these uh, vertical tabs and if I have a, had a question about any kind of insurance or any kind of problem, any kind of patient problem, I would just simply uh, look. It would Everything was, of course, alphabetical. I'd just look it up in my little filing cabinet. That way, everything was all in one area. So this is my um, house filing cabinet, and I keep everything in it. I'm trying to fix my tripod here. Um, of course, there's a lot of private, personal things in here, so I can't show everything. But these are very hard for me to find. I can't find these one page. Eventually, I will. Uh, I looked at Amazon, and they gave you six blank ones for $11, which I thought was kind of expensive. So I used what I could, and then I just had these alphabetical um, tabs and I just cut them I punched holes in them and then cut them to fit my file cabinet now this isn't filled up the way I had it filled up when I worked but it has my problem is I have little sticky notes all over the house and in, in different areas and I want everything to be in one spot so uh, for instance <clears throat> Let's see, knitting. Let me go to knitting. I always need to refer how back to how to cast off. So I taped my casting off notes in here. Um, let's see, music. I have under M, of course. And these are my favorite symphonies if I want to plug them into my a phone or something I can just refer back to this now I know a lot of people have their notes in their phone I like to see things on paper I always have <clears throat> I have P these this is where I keep my passwords um, let's see what else um, how to make laundry detergent which I probably will never do that. Uh, let's see if there's anything under J. <clears throat> H is for just things about hurricanes. These are all the hurricanes we've been through and how many days we were without power. Sometimes you want to refer back and look. So let's see what else do I have already written in that I'm allowed to show. I don't think that there's that many this is private 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 I have under C company when my sister comes things I don't want to forget to show her or talk to her about <clears throat> and then when my best friend comes from California I have a list going I don't know when they can come and visit us again because of uh, COVID but I like to keep a list so I don't forget so that is my filing cabinet. I was able to take a lot of things out of my planner agenda because I do like to keep it separate. I know the golden rule of Franklin Covey is to not have multiple planners, but I like I like the three that I have. I have my filing cabinet, I have my planner, and I have my journal. I like to keep them separate. And then I have my list agenda which I want to put in here because it's just easier to refer to 
So if this video helped you, let me know in the comments below. And if you have any ideas about your planner or agenda, that would be good to share with all of us. So I hope you enjoyed this and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone. Love you.